Hi everyone, Gino here and today we're going to check out another camera accessory. This time it's going to be a very useful attachment for your camera strap. This is the unboxing and review of the small rig rapid link connectors. Let's go. And before we start, I just want to say thank you guys for tuning in and if you are new to the channel, please do subscribe and like the video as this helps the channel grow and it will be highly appreciated. Thank you. Small Rig was established in 2007 and is one of the leading manufacturers of affordable and high quality camera accessories. They are well known for their camera rigs, cages, plates, clamps, adapters, handles, grips, and now they are venturing into camera bags and shoulder straps. The Small Rig Rapid Link Connector is a quick release system for your camera strap. This tool will allow you to quickly attach and detach your neck or shoulder strap from the camera body. An example use case is that when you need to mount your camera to a piece of equipment, that having a strap on would be cumbersome or unnecessary. Like when you need to use your camera on a gimbal or a vlogging tripod. The package comes in this cute small rig box. Inside we get two rapid link connectors, three triangle split rings, and a marketing paperwork. So here are the two rapid link connectors. A rapid link connector weighs only 2 gram and can hold weights up to 70 kilograms as per the small rig's website. It has two parts. The connector link, which hooks up to the camera, and a connector base, which is where you attach your strap. Do note that the buckle can accommodate straps with a width of less than 19 millimeters. The plastic material used seems pretty sturdy and there's no brittly feeling at all. The thickness of the link's cable seems to be just right as well. For the locking mechanism, there are two grooves on each end of the button and this will latch onto the connector base once it's inserted all the way through. And this spring-loaded pin here will push the button towards the other side of the latch, fastening the connectors in place. To detach the connector, we just need to press the button here to unfasten the latch. Next, we need to push the button outward to completely detach the link connector. Note that there's a slight resistance when I'm pushing the button outwards. The center area of the base has this patterned surface that adds a bit of friction and makes the detaching process more secure. And to reattach the link connector, you just need to align the button here and pull it back in. You'll hear a popping sound which indicates that the link connector is properly locked in place. For the installation, we first need to attach our Sony camera strap onto the connector base like this. Next, we need to insert the link connector into the split ring and then make this looping knot to secure it in place. Since my A6400 already has its split rings, I'm not going to use the included ones. Alright, we have successfully installed the small rig rapid link connectors to our camera. Our stock Sony camera strap is now officially a quick release strap. Yay! Yeah. Now for the final thought. Is the small rig rapid link connectors worth it? The answer is yes. It's a must-have, especially for those individuals who do a lot of gimbal work or other similar use cases that don't require a camera strap. The small rig rapid link connectors eliminates the tedious process of having to put on and take off a camera strap. The design of the locking and quick release is secure and it works seamlessly. There are no plasticky or bendy moving parts when attaching and detaching the links. For an asking price of $9.90, this is a great value and it makes the OEM counterpart somewhat irrelevant. The best alternative to this would be the Peak Design Anchor Links that cost twice the price. And for the negatives, I only have two minor complaints, though this might be a deal breaker for others. For the first one, 
the strap buckle on the connector base is too wide for my stock Sony neck strap. My strap is moving loosely on the buckle and it doesn't look appropriate. Small rig can fix this by adding a second buckle on the base connector that can fit smaller straps like the one I have. Second would be the availability. You can only buy this at AliExpress or on the small rig website. I bought mine with free shipping plus a $3 discount at the small rigs merchant page on AliExpress. I've waited a whole month for the package to be delivered but I believe the wait was truly worth it. And that's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I hope to see you guys again on the next one. This is Gino from GTV. Ciao!